What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's Dan here. I'd like to welcome you guys back to UFC 2 Career Mode. Uh, when we left off, we just fought the Iceman again, and prior to that, we faced John Jones, and that was a really, really solid fight, but I think I only have two left in me for my career, so this could potentially be the very last video for the Career Mode, but let's see. I don't think I'm ever going to face Corey Anderson, which is stupid, because I've been top contender ever since the weight change, which happened, I don't know how many videos ago at this point. Oh, whoa, whoa, what, I, well, I had my foot in my mouth because I'm actually facing him right now. I can actually refuse it. Why would I, why would I pick to fight, oh my god, can you imagine the domination of Elliot Harper? The dude's a 74 overall. He'd get destroyed. Of course I'm going for the title fight. The title fight. I said that very enunciated, didn't I? This one's actually going to be relatively close. So yeah, definitely I'm taking it, of course. The title fight against Corey Anderson. So I wasn't sure. I, I guess I had my foot in my mouth there. I'm glad I was wrong, and I'm glad that we have a title shot, finally. So I guess we'll go out in retirement as the light heavyweight champion. Or at least that's the plan. So let's train hard, because we're not going to be training that much anymore. Uh, I think I want to up my, my ground a bit. I think I want to boost the ground and pound to get that maxed out. Oh, look at the damage you'll sustain. But it doesn't matter. Holy crap, even the mediums is a high chance. So we're going to go with the easies then. We're getting so senior, like we're getting tired of being kicked in the face. <laughs> and whatnot, so... I totally get it. I do get it. <laughs> Alright, those are maxed out. The clinch, I might as well work on the clinch. Oh, okay good. The medium is because it's so low. It's still just a medium chance. But hell, that could be the one that decides it. How we doing? Ah, uh, we lost a bit of clinch throws. I, I should have known. Takedown defense is pretty high, but I think I want to keep going with these. Up that clinch. Get our average to like an 80. What are we sitting at? Like about an 87? So if we can get to an 88, we'll be kind of like even with, uh, with Anderson here. All right, the main event, UFC 268 in Newark, New Jersey. Let's get it done. We got to win this championship. Oh, I'm still an 87 overall, but we're relatively the same. I have a much better stand-up. He's only at about, I think, an 88, and I'm sitting at 100. So comparatively, we're very close. So as long as I keep him on, on standing up, hell, even down low, we're very evenly matched. But I take him on the stand-up. So let's get this title. Coming up next, it's a light heavyweight title fight between Corey Anderson and the gentleman. The gentleman looking to beat down the champion and leave tonight as the new light heavyweight champion. As and that'll be a solid way to stage, end it. He understands this is one of the you biggest know, like, moments in his life. The biggest moment in his career. He is looking to take this title, and he believes his time is now. His preparation has gone perfectly. He is in outstanding shape. He has a great game plan and a great camp, and he believes that he will emerge the new champion of the world tonight after this fight. But the thing is, man, like, I've already won a championship, so it's not the biggest moment of my life. Sure, it's a big moment. It's just another line on my resume at this stage. Like, undefeated so far. Um, already was a middleweight champion for and defended at Corey least Anderson. five times. Six times, Making I mean. So this will just be another thing for me. Oh, there are the USA chants. Right on fucking cue. The champion is in focus. He is in his prime. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this camp has been absolutely spectacular. He believes he has a solid game plan, and his mentality coming into this fight is clear and focused. All right, well, I'm ready to deal with him because, like I said, we're very similar match, except I take him on the stand-up. So, and that's my that's my specialty, as you guys are very much aware. <laughs> but I'm ready for him. All right, Brucey, introduce our us. Tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. The gentleman is 34. Anderson. God, is I'm 36. 34 in this game you now. Have an eight inch reach advantage. Nine years Bruce in UFC. Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon, Herb D. Now, 
This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. It's gonna be mine in a second, buddy. This man is a wrestler, holding professional record of 15 wins, one loss. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed USC light heavyweight champion of the world, Corey Beeston, 25. I totally missed that, what his nickname was. But it sounded pretty ridiculous. All right, so for the championship, you can give me your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves is my The fighters touch gloves, and we are set Good. for this highly I still don't get why matchup. I didn't touch gloves with, uh, with Luke over there. And here we go. All right, man. He's quite a bit taller than me. He's very long legs. For the champion, we have been witnessing. Is he wearing the gold trunks? Championship fights over the years, but you have garnered as much enthusiasm as this matchup. It is certainly safe to say that this may be. Oh! Oh! Fight on his head! Come on, work his head quick! Huge bomb from the top. Oh! Side control. I'm gonna let him up. I think. Looking for his back. Oh, he got out of it. Let's go right back there. Half guard. Excellent posture here. Oh, I want to get up. I almost had him, but he got, he, he had a good recovery. Grabs a hold of the wrist, pins it down from here. He's looking for the Kimura. I'm out. Get your Kimura cheese out of here, man. Big punch from the bottom. Just let him up. This is not happening down down now low. Now he's back up to his feet. And there's a takedown attempt. Come on, man. Damaging leg kick. Whoa, I'm a little turned around. Big head kick lands. He hurt him with that hook. Good block. Come on, man. Left hand. That's another big head kick, Joe. I don't know how many more. Oh, I slipped. He gets up. He lands. Oh! Big left hand. Ah, uh, I thought I nicked him there. Come on, Anderson. Just need one well-timed shot. He caught him oh, okay. That's a big hook. Five rounds to deal with this, so we have a lot of time. Come on. Oh, I came close to smacking a cut. The clock here in round one. That's a strong uppercut. Gotta watch that. Oh! Come on, work him. Oh, he got out of he, Keep punching him. He's good at getting out of those. Oh! Keep going! He can't defend! Anderson's almost done. I gotta get him back into full guard. Oh man, this dude is lucky. 
Joe, he's showcasing some great moves. In the half guard. Oh, Damn, he got... He was so run. close to being knocked out. Man, the champion Looks like we're going to the second down, round. He is yet to be beaten. Big round for the challenger. The champ, though, able to survive. This is one great fight. Here's a vicious kick that results in a knockdown. Oh, my... He did a full flip, dude, with that kick. I guess it was more like a somersault. Here's I want to see that again. head kick that lands. Boosh. That was pretty amazing. All right, second round. Dude was so close, man. If he didn't grab me and, and he let me keep battering on him like that, second done round. deal. At least he's a sports. At least he's got sportsmanship. I'll give him that. Some fighters don't. The fighter. the champion oh, good block. Is trying to utilize his game plan, but this contender came to fight tonight. We said he's very confident. You can see that so far in the octagon. I'm not doing so well. Joe, good kick to the body by Anderson. Big right ah, I can't get anything off right now. Joe, that's a solid leg kick by the gentleman. Even I saw that one coming. Pissing me off now, buddy. That one connected. Man, a ton of damage is... Oh, oh, he got right. The champion is hurt here. He is in big trouble. Oh! To cover up. We might be seeing a new champ right now. There it is. Knock him. Knock him. That's it. He's, out. He's, He's done. Out. That's it. That's it. He was a little daisy. Little daisy dukes. Oh, look at this. I've never gone up this way before. Time now for our fight replay. Oh, that hook just brought him to the floor. And I just needed Let's one more wind-up punch. Look at this overhand. Right on the money, oh. and the fight is over as soon as it lands. <laughs> Check out this angle here. Skadoosh. And he's Ooh. out. That was like to the back of the lobe, the ear lobe, here right behind Bruce the ear. Here is with the official decision. Well, you're not going to be wearing that shirt Ladies for a while. The referee Herb Gaines called a stop to this contest. At one minute, 30 seconds of round number two. You're playing the winner by knockout. Gentleman. The gentleman is the new UFC light heavyweight champion. That's just another thing, man. Another I've managed to make two titles. I could have probably won the welterweight champion if I, championship as well, but you don't have enough time for that. Still standing. I, I'm. I want to see what that's for. Let me look. Does that win like multiple? Multiple titles in your career? Complete 30 fights in your career. Oh, that's what it is. Well, suck me sideways and serve me a milkshake. So what's left for us then? We got a popularity on it. No, one fight, man. It's so obvious. One more fight and we have to retire. So the only thing I can think about doing when we get back is spending some of those experience points and calling it a day and just winning our last fight. I'm curious to know what happens during retirement. That's a thing I'd like to find out. The fight game, retirement warning. Time is an opponent you can only beat for so long and your body won't keep up, keep sustaining the strain of training and fighting for much longer. Keep winning and go out as one of the best there ever was. You bet. I will. I would like to make a 90 as my career, my character, but it looks like I don't, th I, might, I may crack 89 overall, but because of all the stress of fighting, I don't think it's gonna happen. Oh, not this guy again. I don't want to fight this cocksucker. It's a title fight, though, so... And, he, and it's a harder boost. They're just bringing this down for me right now. 30 wins. Popularity gain. Not much I can really do, man. I can work the clinch. That's about it. Short session. Oh, and you're only going to give me a short training session for my last fight. You suck my ass. So I got to make this one count, guys. What's it going to be? I think it might work the clinch. Let's go with the takedown defense. Make it nice and rounded. Hopefully no damage going in. We lost toughness and we lost our takedown a bit. 
That sucks balls. So if anything, I might have lost a stamina point. Or sorry, an attribute point. Not gained one. Let's take a look. Riley, main event. Toronto, Ontario, Canada. So we're in our home country for the last fight ever. We're going to be wearing the championship, the champion trunks going in. I'd say this is a great way to go out. Okay, I'm an 88 overall, so yeah, we didn't move. We stayed at 88, but we got 100, 100 in the stand-up, 83 in the clinch, and an 85 in the ground, but we just can't fight anymore. We're too old, so this will be our 30 record. We have to go out with a win. We can't lose. We got to stay undefeated. Coming up next, a collision for the UFC light heavyweight belt. He doesn't deserve it. He's not number one. He's in seventh. And EA, like, wiped his ass by giving him a damn near 100 rank. So he such chocolate the cheddar. And tonight, a huge I don't know what that is. The biggest opportunity of his fighting career as he battles for the UFC Light Heavyweight Championship. He has been amongst the best, amongst the elite for years. And he is confident he will leave with the belt. As he makes his way towards his cage, he believes this is his time. He believes he is destined to take this title. His preparation for this bout has gone absolutely according to plan. He's in fantastic shape with a great game plan, and he expects to walk out of this cage tonight as the new champion. All right, this is my last fight, guys. Come on, I want to hear you on your feet. Toronto! What a journey for the it champ. has been for the current champion, who has spoken lately about the possibility of retiring. He didn't say when, he didn't say why, he just has been in so many battles that his body can only take so much more. Not just the fights, but the training camp. But man, he's fun to watch. Look at that. The That's an impressive feat. Has won 30 right fights, now. has He's had 30 his fights. Way towards the cage. His training for this bout has been perfect. Everything ran according to plan. He believes he has a solid game plan and he's ready to step in here and retain his title. Wouldn't Good it be job. great to knock him out in the first 30 seconds? Wouldn't that be a nice little light heavyweight championship? Little go out, give me that trophy and everything. For this light heavyweight championship fight. He's got we're the same age, he's got three inches on me, and he's got that six inch reach advantage. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And with the attribute is our referee in charge, Herb D. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the Air Canada Center in Toronto, Ontario. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 28 wins, 11 losses. He stands 63 inches tall, weighing in at 204 pounds. Fighting out of New York, New York, presenting the challenger, the king! And now the king! Fighting out of the red corner! This man is a Taekwondo fighter, holding a professional record of 30 wins, no losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. One last He's time. The reigning, defending, undisputed UFC light heavyweight champion of the world, the gentleman. All right, let's do it. All right, this is for the championship. Give me your instruction in the dress room. You know, protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. I, this guy gave me a bit of a hard time, I think. I can't remember. A few of these guys, we've gone into the... He has to give me respect. It's my last fight. Man, Joe, listen to the crowd. They absolutely love this fighter. He has given them some great shows over the years, and you can see how much they appreciate it. It doesn't matter where he fights. He always gets this type of reception from the fan. Oh, my God. I'm not letting him do it that way. No way.
I gotta slow down with those. Slow down. Big hit him hard with that hook. Oh, I gotta watch out. Solid straight left. That was a big knee. Vicious knees. Back it up. Oh, solid jab. Oh, that's a vicious kick. Oh my god. Couldn't get out of that. There he is. He got the takedown. Get up, get up, get up. He's inside control here. He's letting me up. That's his method, though. This guy's a kickboxer, right? He connects with the straight. Oh, I hate it when it, you gotta hit the combo. Solid shot to the body. Oh, did he snap that kick? Oh, wrong kick. Oh, that one hurt him. So yeah, now I'm slowing down. Hold on. I gotta wait for him. Big left, swinging a miss. Crap. Great defense as he blocks that body shot. Good defense, and he counters with the Ooh. jab. Nope, back it up. He's beating me right now. One minute on the clock here in round one. Oh, spinning heel kick. But you got to get the combos. He parries the kick away. Oh, head kick. Nice jab. Oh. Get him now. Come on, punch him! Oh, that is some lucky bullshit. I almost had him. The ref almost got kicked in the face. That'll do it for round one. Whoa! I almost won that fight right there, but we gotta go into the second round. We're looking a little beaten, a little battered. It really is a testimony to their toughness that they're still up and going after it. Because both fighters look like they were really close to being put away in this fight. So there was a very a even round. He got me and I got him. Down. And here's a flying knee that lands perfectly. Woo. Made him stumble. Here's I gotta work. I, I gotta work on when I'm doing it. I have to go for the punches afterwards as well if I can, because those have been known to just wreck them. Second round. We continue this championship fight, and so far, so good for the top contender. He has worked so God damn. hard for an opportunity to be a UFC He's not even champion. the top contender. What are you talking about? I think it's safe to say that so far, I think it's safe to say shut up. There's a body shot. There's a solid body shot. Oh, I can't get him right now. I'm actually fighting pretty poorly. He hit him with the hook. Jesus. Oh! He is in big trouble. Oh! Come on! That's it! He's done. Just like that, guys. That's all it takes. Round and pound. Woo! Going out with a bang. Let's take a look at the replay. This is the shot that drops him. Perfect technique. He's clearly in big, big trouble. That Let's was a gorgeous one. Well, what a beautiful here. way to go this out with my favorite the kick. And the subsequent follow-up strikes for the knockout. Check it out here. Bam! Boom! Oh. And then he's out. That is murder. Bruce Bumper has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Gaines called a stop to this contest at one minute, five seconds of round number two. Going to win by knockout and still the undisputed UFC right heavyweight champion of the world, the gentleman. The gentleman remains. There should the be a UFC special light heavyweight champion. There should really be a special, you know, like going away ceremony for me. I had to win that in, in you know, 
my home country. Final fight of the career. That's it. I'm done. Retirement. I still got some evolution points, but they're kind of useless. So let's see what happens. It's probably just going to be like, oh yeah, that's it. If you want to do another one, you do another one. That'd be pretty lame, but I hope it's something cool. Last fight. With your contract coming to an end... Oh, speculation is rampant that your next fight will be your last. You've been a true warrior throughout your career. And this last chapter should be no different. Get out there and give the fans one last... Oh, so th this isn't the last one. Now it is. Okay, we'll keep... Uh, you know what? I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm going to split this video here and we're going to go out with one last fight, one last video. That's what we're going to do. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. Favorite it as well. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you haven't yet, be sure to follow me on my social media. Those links are down below in the description. A uh, very good idea to follow me on there. Great, you know, great way to chat with me out of YouTube. Um, you know, exclusive giveaways, things like that. It's a good idea. Uh, also, if you want to get a shirt or hoodie, there's a link to my Spreadshirt shop as well. So if you want to check that out, you can. Other than that, though, we'll see you in one final video for the UFC career where we'll take our last fight and go into retirement. So thanks again, guys, for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Knox Hill, take it away. Who's the man with the plan? Hmm. If you feel trouble, wild and wild, don't need violent and hit Q8000. Wait a minute, hold that style, it's now Dan. Goddamn, Billy Jack, we still riding tires flat. I hear them sirens, sea shots flying, so we driving fire back. If they ain't vibing, lie with that. Got me dressed up in all black. What up? Hood up, and I see them haters. Try to run with us, they gon' need inhalers. Gotta breathe them hard, just like the beta players. Grab your respirators, night invaders get life savored. Mass on for the shooters, move like trash to bed intruder. Got that Glock and got them woofers, just Press play, I'll keep it moving. Who is Knox? Still, you damn fools. Keep it fresh like canned food. There ain't nothing we can't do, so tune into that damn kill. Yeah. It was never, ever a game.